what are generic classes in java how can we use a generic class and implement a program with the help of it hello everyone i am sukanya from goedo hub technologies and in this video we are going to discuss about a generic class and then implement a program with the help of it so a class that can refer to any particular type is known as a generic class here we are using a t type parameter to create the generic class of specific type generics in java is similar to templates in c++ the idea is to allow type that is integer string etc and user defined types to be a parameter to methods classes and interfaces as with generic methods the type parameter section of a generic class can have one or more type of parameters separated by commas these classes are known as parameterized classes or parameterized types because they accept one or more parameters so here you can see that we have created a generic class class name is mygen and one parameter t is passed t object is created with the help of this pointer this object it refers to the pointer of t object and then to use that particular generic class we have created a class test3 and in the void main method we have described the type that is integer type and added 2 as a number to this particular generic class or the object of the generic class now if i add this particular m dot at go edu hub then it will show me compile time error because there is only one parameter and that is integer so it cannot take the string values only integer type of data is accepted and then we have retrieved the value with the help of get method that is m dot get and it returns the value is 2 so let us execute this program and see the functioning of it so here you can see that i have written the same code which i have explained just now and i have commented the line of string otherwise it will show me a compile time error next when i execute this particular program here you can see that firstly i have run the file which i have saved so i have saved that as mygen.java and then i have run the class file and it shows me that the retrieve value is true then you can see here that if i execute this particular line then why it will display a particular error because it is only for integer numbers not for the other data type if i want to add that particular data type also then i have to take a new generic class pointer and then i have to separate it with commas so this is how generic class works in java and we have also seen the working of program for more concepts and programs of java we will look into upcoming videos thank you